Hello, hello to all the amazing people. The Neomer here with some more cards of our tropical island and uh, Guidemans Revels on his past 100 days. That's pretty cool. Last time we caught some goats and we got some <laughs> nice names. Sadly, I cannot use all of them. So um, there's a couple of them which go really nice with each other. But hey, <laughs> I was so in a rush to finish the episode before it got to one hour that uh, I didn't even give water to the goats. Sorry for that rushy ending, but it worked. It worked. Uh, actually, um, I started carry. I started caring about uh, consistency and how long the videos turn to HD and stuff and it turns out if it's less than one hour there's a significant difference between the time it takes anyhow we're gonna grab the clay vase we're gonna use the clay vase here to give water to the goats we're gonna leave it in the goat uh, goats heaven here there we go and gonna put another one and goats do drink a lot of water, but don't worry, they also give milk, which is like uh, water, but just better, because it also gives uh, food, which is pretty good. Right, as for the names, the ones I chose, and thanks to everyone else who also gave names, maybe we'll have more goats, so the names will be used. First one will be by Universanity, he chose uh, Chancellor Alekmet, I kind of like that name a lot so we're gonna go and can we copy paste oh we can that's pretty good apply and then for the goat well mm, golden city uh suggested sir milkton but um since uh, since we already named our male goat uh, it will have to be a lady milktone lady milkatone like it's gonna give us a lot of milk I, at least i think that was that was the idea there but anyway uh right they look pretty similar actually yeah but the bale goat has the beard that's how you can see it also when you go here oh that's kind of such a shame look at that overlap there oh anyhow chancellor lekmet and lady milkaton had a lovely night last night and uh, as a result there's a small baby goat growing inside lady milkaton what a nice time to be alive here we're we gonna get oh empty that and since we were doing like a little bit of a crunch last time, things are not doing that great. We are super hungry, so we're gonna need to go and figure out what we're gonna eat. Uh, surely we have something we can uh, nom nom nom. Let's see. Let's see in the food basket, we have some eggs. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, are we tired of eggs? Not yet, so that's good. Okay, now we are, all right. All right, all right. It seems like we are out of wood, so we're gonna need to work on that. Oh, we got some oysters here. Mr. Nibbles, can you open oysters? You can't, but they're free to open anyway, so. Okay, let's check out my dear friends here, Jeffrey and Mr. Nibbles. Gonna give them some water, there we go. Wonderful. There. And the rest of the water, I'm just gonna drop off into the reservoirs. With three nice reservoirs having some water from us for us here. We like, uh, we are carefree, really, we are. We got a lot of fertilizer. We'll probably carry it into the dark cave. Uh, okay, we started making glue, but we need height for it. And uh, yeah, I would like to make. Uh, so, one of the short term goals is to make a sea trophy, but we're gonna need fresh, uh, fresh uh, letter to make glue out of. And I would like to show you malaria, so. Mm, it's gonna happen relatively soon we're gonna be talking about it okay uh but first things first let's make sure we are not turbo hungry what do we have in here Got some sugar and dried chilies okay we could make a chili thing i guess right yeah let's make some uh, some nice curry okay we're gonna grab a shovel i'm gonna go and uh oh a mouse now oh, there we go and another mouse there we go mau ma ma mice eating day my sitting day it's a nice my sitting day check the gift a coconut well i do like coconuts thank you very much jeffrey i think that was jeffrey okay okay now we're gonna grab one of the yams and i said i'm not gonna do that i said i'm not gonna wield the knife around while monkeys are jumping around if my finger slips now oh, that's one that makaki there okay there we go i'm gonna do the yams okay now we're gonna need some water I wonder, can you can you soak yams in coconut water? You can't. Interesting. I was not expecting that. Okay, then 
Uh, we can use normal water. We'll use normal water. Or we can use salt water, of course, but... There's no reason to do it. Um, uh, honey, okay. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Oh, where did that go? Why did that go? Okay. That's a bit weird, but fine. Uh, there we go. Soak the yams. Cook them up. Uh, let's take like one hour break while we're waiting for that. Good, good, good. Empty these. Grab the chili. And let's see. Let's make, let's make our favorite food, the yam curry. Bam. Good. Nice. And while we're waiting for that, we're gonna go and woodcut a little bit. Because it seems like we're a little bit low on wood. This will be a chill episode. <clears throat> I don't have a plan to rush any, like, uh, super big projects or anything. It's a Saturday, so... Um, I want to, like... Go on a little bit of a trip or something. So yeah, I just woke up. We'll be doing a little bit recording. There's gonna be less videos over the weekend than usual. Um, okay, let's wash. And the food is ready. Nice. So yeah, today there's gonna be this video. I also uploaded one old videos I recorded of orcs. So yeah, I did finish that episode. For those who are watching orcs, uh, I did finish the series. I wanna say. And um, yeah. Another video is coming today, and then I have one more, and yeah, and yeah, and then tomorrow I will upload the extreme drought episode that I'm gonna record that today, and that's gonna be it for this weekend probably. And then from Monday things will go back to normal. Uh, okay, so there's the buck repellent if you might need it. Although if you wanna show up malaria, then that's probably not the best thing to do. But hey, we'll see. Okay, cool. Right, uh, let's go and check out our traps. We're gonna go a little bit train on the beach. Uh, what I really would like to do, though, is I would like to catch some uh, get some lizards for later. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna grab some salt here. We're gonna salt the fish. There we go. Some more training. We need like 50 swimming for me to show you like uh, some interesting things. Okay, climbing, not, not sure why exactly I train climbing, but I don't know, we are. Okay, well, one fish is going to be enough, we're going to salt it. Oh, forgot my salted salt there. Oh, where did that come from? What in the world? Where did that come from? That was so weird. Where did that cup of water come from? I'm so confused right now. <laughs> Okay. Am I dreaming? Is this just a dream of a dream of a dream? Nothing is real, what it seems seems to be. Okay. Let's wash. Uh, and let's put this back on our shoulder. The gear looks mostly alright. Right now we're gonna go and woodcut some more. And then we're gonna carry the, the excess thing into the caves probably. There we go. And some more wood there let's check how the partridges are doing hello there ladies and extinguished gentlemen all right let's feed them because i know when it's the next time we're gonna come here fertilized egg like we don't have enough of them already right we still didn't eat danny okay <laughs> danny will be so delicious when we finally decide to do it I will not be naming the rest of the partridges because, well, they're probably gonna eat them when we are hungry, so... Right, and then the salt went out, but we can see it. So how can we salt this fish now? Yeah, that's quite a conundrum, really, is. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Anyhow, uh, let's go to the... Okay, useful crap. Right, pick up. Now, can we put some things inside? It seems like we have a lot of stones here, so we're gonna grab a couple of those. Okay, we got an, a yarn, I think. Where did we put yarns? Into tailoring, right? Yeah, okay. Uh, right, we got some perforate. We got a lot of coconut shells. We're gonna stay at around 20 and delete the rest. There we go. This thing will not be here anymore, so we can remove it. Okay. <clears throat> Glazed vase. 
we'll use for oil and oil only so that's fine sap we can remove oh look at that some more oil here bam right cooking pots honey can we store the honey somewhere no we can what happens if you cook the honey you can't cook the honey okay there we go there we go okay we got some wood shavings that's kind of useful i'm gonna put that into our satchel here and then the rest we're gonna store okay uh I'm going to keep a couple of burned bones here just in case. Oh, it's not so hot anymore, so we can use leather shoes instead of these. But that's fine. We're going to wait for those to break down first. Then we're going to switch. We've got some beeswax, a palm front. Okay, some wood checks. We got Veston. We are getting a little bit lonely. I'm going to talk to him real fast. There we go. Uh, got some beeswax. We're going to leave the beeswax here. Okay. So it seems like we don't have that much crop anyway. Got some rotten coconuts, we'll carry those. And honey we'll probably gonna eat at some point. Okay. We have a lot of these, so we should probably not do more. Uh yeah, okay. Let's go. Put the things inside the dark cave. It's gonna be inside. Okay, let's check out grasslands just real fast here to see. Yeah, okay, another goat. Okay, I was thinking that might have happened. Uh, right, so we're gonna grab it. It's gonna be a little bit heavy to carry back, but that's all right. I'm gonna rearm the trap. This time we're gonna put some meat into it and try to catch the lizard. Okay, uh, goat's heaven. There we go release and i did had another suggestion which i did not write down because i was not expecting to catch another goat um vincent one goat oh so many nice goat names male goat names but there's only one guys i need you to like go and uh give me some female names yeah i'm missing a female name imagine that all male names Yep, uh, give me some female names, please. We have a female goat. It's a female goat. It can be called Billy or Vincent. It's a female goat, so yeah. Anyhow, Chancellor Lechman's gonna have a lot of work to do. I can tell you that much. Anyway, let's go into the... Into the... Uh, what shall we call it? The, um, the wetlands, right? Wetlands. And we're gonna unload. Now, I don't have enough time to go check the highlands and stuff so much water though we are living in a water paradise right now i mean i guess we could enter let's see one two three four five yeah the more the more stuff you have here the worse it gets but yeah it helps the rest of the island if you leave things here though oh look at that we're gonna grab the shark jaws because we are working towards making that uh other than that I think we're fine. Okay. Anything in here? No. Uh, let's grab a candle or two. And uh, let's go and check out the highlands. Okay. I want to check if there's some goats there. So deep jungle. So we're probably not going to make it back on time. Okay. The bees. Oh, look at that. An artificial beehive. I should feed it sugar with water to help it grow. So the, the honey is already almost 100%. Now, it says this might be dangerous. Uh, we need to come back with a torch. We'll come back tomorrow with a torch. Okay, I did not expect this thing to fill up so fast. I guess it fills up really fast if you have a lot of jasmine flowers. Right. Okay. Okay, nothing here except some roses and the... Black Monkey Gang, Western Highlands, Leaf Stride, that's alright, Eastern Highlands, okay, another goat, mm. <laughs> alright, um, what can I say, and I think we're gonna be done here for now, so at this place I think there are only goats and we only ha already have quite a few, so we'll be fine for now, okay, let's go back. Let's take a bit of a break before we faint. Although the game would probably not allow us to travel. 
We should probably grab some resources while we're here, because why not? Deep jungle. Yeah, I was right. We didn't make it back in time. Okay. Metland. And then finally, there we go. Another goat. So we need two goat names. We need two goat names. Everyone wants to name the male goat. And well, the only person who got to name it was the first good name I saw, and that was Chancellor Lakmet. There we go. Yeah, really sorry for those other male names. So we got two female goats. You know what? Female goats are the heroes here, really. Chancellor Lackman, he doesn't do much. He does his one thing once per day, and after that he just lazes around and lies all the time. So these are the real champions, so you should be happy to name the female ones. Okay. They are the ones who's gonna give us milk. They're the ones who's gonna produce us even more goats. No, they're they are the real heroes. Okay, anyhow, let's turn this thing off. I'm gonna store the candles inside the chest. Okay, let's take all the wood out. Okay, shark jaws we like possibly, hopefully, probably need. Uh, we'll need some... Oh, there's the salt, good. No, the fish is gonna take a little bit of salt. So... We're not gonna be able to start trapping the lizard right away. Hmm. But what would a lizard um, like to eat if this thing's not dried up? I don't know. Anyhow, we are hungry again. Did we make that? Yeah, I'm correct. We did. Okay. There we go. So for now, that's gonna be fine. Drink a little bit here. Give some to my lovely friends. Wonderful. Who goes with me? There we go. All right. This looks good. This looks good. Good, good, good. All right. How are the bug bites? Yeah, going down now. Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to use that or not. I'll think about it. So this is like the hole if I want to show malaria or not. Uh, how's the fuel though? Yeah, it could use a little bit feeding. There we go. And let's go and make like a cord or something. And I'm going to go to sleep. So we're gonna need some more cords. I don't know really exactly for what, but uh, for something, for something. So life is pretty good here on the island. Now we have all the animals, I think. We got partridges, we got goats, we got monkeys, we got bees. I think that's about it. You cannot domesticate a shark, sadly. So yeah, that's gonna have to be it. It would be cool if you could domesticate a shark, build, the, build him a huge swimming pool and then, you know. <laughs> Okay, this thing's 9% right. Right, so in one night, so in a couple of days, it's gonna be ready. I could try trapping a lizard with a fresh piece of fish, but I think that's gonna like... I think it. this might work, actually. Uh, let's try this thing. Let's try this thing. And let's see how that goes. Uh, so, let's go to grasslands. And we're gonna put... I wonder if this dries faster if you put it on the drying rack. You can't even put it on the drying rack, okay? Yeah, I think it, this might work as a bait. And we're gonna go and catch more fish for some more fish fish bait. We're gonna use that for both boars and the lizards. So we're gonna need a lot of salted fish. Uh, salted fish is really good for catching, like... Um, uh, did we find the rocks? We did not... Uh, no, we are the bay. Oh, right. Of course, we are the bay. I'm like... Tree has coconuts again. Okay. That's nice, I guess. It always had coconuts. I never really took coconuts from there anyway, so... I don't know what it is, is it talking about. We never explored the rocks. Well, why would be? Oh, hello there. Um... Not very useful though. Okay, some food. I don't mind. Get some fish. Maybe like stab a seagull if it flies nearby. Just a nice day of training here at the rock place. Okay, let's head back. Let's grab the rope out. Okay. Uh, it's important to be in shape. So we made ourselves nice and comfortable so we can lazy around. But uh, now uh, it's like... It's time to, you know, go and train train our very important skills here. 
swimming, uh, spearfishing, climbing, all that good jazz. Okay, let's go to the uh, to the bay. There we go. Oh, hello there, Mister or Missus. Wasn't able to get it. Yeah, spear fighting fifty five. But those monkeys, they really can run away easily. Another shark encounter, maybe, possibly. No, just some seaweed. All right, that's fine. That's fine. I don't mind. A little bit of dive, a little bit of that. Another climb, maybe. Oh, I actually climbed it. Oops. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> well, I got super lucky there. I was so, so close to having to show you how to treat uh, fractures and splints. Whoops. <laughs> the message was feeling confident, though, so maybe it was not as bad as I supposed, but, you know. We need some more food for the partages tomorrow, I think. Yeah, it's like running out. Uh, or if you don't feel like it, you can just um, shove anything in there, really. There we go. It's not as efficient as bird feet, but... Okay, how's the goat heaven looking like right now? Yep, they are doing a lot of poo-poo, that's for sure. Four goats already, that's pretty nice. I really do wonder if that uh, salted bait will catch... Uh, catch a lizard and I forgot to bring the fertilizer to the caves whoops okay drop that out now we're gonna need to eat something today uh, the oysters are the meal of the day and the, this thing almost uh, lost its things we're gonna salt the fish we're gonna put it uh, okay something got spoiled not sure what that was oh we have salt inside there as well I'm just being stupid okay right so we're gonna do that uh, there you go there you go, good. Fish, let's... Oh, we got another fish. Okay, let's salt that one as well. Uh, cooking, right. So, our meal is done. There we go. We can cook these as well. Okay, we got the water bottle, which I really don't care about. We can put some honey in it. There we go. Okay. Then we got some crushed coconuts, because of course we do. Come on, Jeffrey, time to earn your wage. And by wage, I mean bugs and stuff that we feed you with. Okay, okay, go there. Let's open a couple of coconuts, give them some coconut water. Uh, and then we might like... Yeah, this bug repellent we didn't really need. I'm gonna stop using bug repellent and we will like... Um, uh... We'll see, like, I'm just gonna, like, play, you know, fast and comfortable, not worry too much about things, and what happens, happens, right? So what will happen probably is that uh, I might get malaria, so then we're gonna talk about how to deal with it. Uh, we already have some powders, so we should be fine regarding that. There we go. Nice. Okay, so there's some food there we can eat. I'm actually gonna cook a little bit first though. There we go. Good. Cook some oil. Let's go. Uh, right, a couple more oysters. And we are sleepy, so we'll need to go to sleep. Oh, look at that. Some pearls. Nice. So how many do we have right now? We have three. Okay. Well, that's gonna be cool. A little bit of tired of eating mollusk. How about some coconuts, right? For the good old days. Oh, hello there. What are you gonna grab? A broom. And it was a good broom as well. Oh, he's like, nope, you're not gonna clean. <laughs> uh, oh, no, no. They, they just want to have their cave be like nice and clean. That's it. Like, they don't want to live in a mess. And I can understand that. Nobody wants to live in a mess. Like, uh, it's, you know... Uh... He saw how nice this place is for our domesticated monkeys. And he was like, hey, we could go and clean our own place as well. Why would we live in a dirt if we don't have to? So yeah, I guess monkeys are going to be cleaning their den now. That's fine. That, that's They needed a new broom for that. Like, they couldn't use my old shabby broom. No, no, that wouldn't work, would it? So, yeah. Right. Um, okay. <laughs> I didn't know they can grab the broom. Makes sense, though, right? Why wouldn't they be able to? So... Okay, I don't think we're gonna need those. Okay, let's clean and I'm gonna need a new broom. 
Broom, broom, broom. Uh, why do we have this basket with me? It just like encumbers us. This is a useful crab basket, so. Right, well, we're gonna need a new broom then, shall we? Uh, but first, let's get some fuel. All right, I know what I went out to get. I went out to get a small palm. I was like, okay, let's go out and cut down a small palm. But then I was like, hey, we don't... Wait, what? I didn't find one. And then I was like, we don't, we don't need sticks. We have plenty. I don't know if we actually need palm fronts. But then I remembered the next moment, so... I don't know how useful this monologue is, but hey. Um, right, there we go. Good. Oh, no, 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 you can't have another one. No, this one's... I'm holding it strong in my hands. You can grab something else, though. A spindle? You... So from all the things, a spindle, that's so important for me. What are you making? Clothes now, guys? Like, I don't know, we're gonna have a monkey, uh, Planet of the Apes scenario here if we don't put an end to it soon. They're, they're cleaning their homes, they are, they are, uh, they're making spindles, uh, they're making clothes. They're like, I don't know, this, this is dangerous. This is dangerous. Not sure, not sure if we, we can like, uh, put a blind eye to it. Uh, it looks super bad. Anyhow. Like I was thinking about making like a like a trap uh, in the in the wetlands for the boars. We could do that, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Let's make a trap in the wetlands for the boars. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Let's grab our lovely shovel and let's start digging. Now this is this this is the moment we might get malaria though. That's fine. We need to show that off as well. Unless we die from dehydration here, the things are starting to go. Okay, we're gonna need eight stones. No problem, let's wash here. Here we go, we're gonna go back, uh, grab some stones. Eight, right? And then we're gonna need some sticks and leaves as well. So there's one stick there, and like we think we saw like eight stones, right? And leaves. Well, all of that we can get in the in the wetlands. And well, let's grab one of the fish that's being salted. So this is the way I recommend you to do it. Like if you want boar stuff, use a trap. Don't go and poke it with a stick and don't try to pierce it with an arrow. Trust me, that's not gonna work out. Always trap the boars. Well, you do you, right? That's just a recommendation though. Anyhow, where is that trap anyway? Oh, it's there. Let's put it all the way to the left here. And there we go. Oh, look at that. Yep, we're definitely going to have some malaria issues. That's all right, though. Okay. Uh, I forgot to drink before we left. So if your bug bites get too high, uh, it doesn't show here. Why doesn't it show that it's causing malaria? Okay, so we're gonna go into our stats here. I'm gonna go eternal. Uh, nope, we're gonna go physical, damage, mental. Okay, let's go find our immune system then. So let's see. Our immune system, I'm gonna click on the parasites here. We're gonna pin it. So this is like, uh, no, not parasites. <clears throat> okay, bacteria. Diarrhea, cholera, fever. Okay, there we go. Parasite malaria. Right. So this, this thing. So when the when the mosquitoes bite you, they put this larva under your skin, and then they start turning into insects, and they make more larva. And this thing can get out of hand really fast. So yeah, always try to avoid the the, the malaria thing. But since we uh, want to like show it off we'll do exactly that so yeah we're gonna need a whole bunch of sticks so we're gonna go and explore a little bit to find some let's see the x there we go so that's two sticks i'm gonna need some more 
as the black bites go up, the, the mala red thing will also go up faster and faster. And it starts pretty slow, but then once you have some, it's like kind of really hard to get rid of it. It like gets worse and worse. Okay. And look at that, we almost fully explore this place. And then of course, I'm one stick short and games like, oh no, I'm not good. <laughs> and games like, oh, look at that, your axis broke would be a shame if you couldn't finish your trap. Well, joke's on you, the trap's finished. Okay, uh, there we go. So we're gonna try to catch a boar here, wonderful. And I'm gonna go back, grab the resources, I guess. You could grab, go and grab some bugs for the partridges as well, I guess. Yeah, let's do that. Of course, I'm perfectly aware of my really horrible state of um, of the thirst bar, but uh, don't worry, it takes a while to die from thirst, so you're nowhere near there. I'm covered in bug bites, they're eating me alive. This thing is going up so slow though. Like, what the heck? I thought it was worse. Yeah, okay, let's, uh, let's you know, let's relieve ourselves a little bit here. Uh, no reason to get super eaten away. I think we have enough bug bites to like successfully raise malaria so you know we have to we have to have all the animals right and there's one thing left over and that's bugs under our skin apparently i think that's how malaria works i'm actually not sure uh, it is a parasite so it has to live inside your body really sorry for all of those of you who like cringe at that kind of stuff it is what it is and we didn't get a rain in a while, so my reservoir is gonna run dry at some point here. Right, uh, okay, so let's put bugs inside here, let's train a little bit of trapping. Oh, okay, it's night. Do we have any which are ready? Yeah, we do. There we go. Let's go inside. There we go. Ah, loading times are alright. It could be better, but hey. Okay, we've got a whole bunch of different food here. There you go. Oh, you're not hungry. Why are you not hungry? Because you brought me a gift. So when they bring you a gift, sometimes they also feed themselves. I think all of the time, actually, when they bring you a gift, they actually feed themselves. So, Okay, fill that thing up. Good. Uh, so how's malaria? Still going up. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna show it off. Uh, we're gonna make some food for the partridges here, although we are kind of tired and sleepy, so we might go and sleep first. How's our mind structure? Look at it, nice and steady. That's what we like to see. That thing, you don't want it to go down. That's the whole reason why we made our place super comfortable. Okay. There we go. It. so some more bird feed and then of course we need to eat as well so we're gonna grab some eggs and gonna eat them good uh, let's make a cord while we're waiting for that there we go okay a little bit tired of eating eggs right so we're gonna leave the rest one in there good so eggs are nice like kind of passive food income that you can have well it's not 100% passive, but it's very close to that. Right, let's sharpen this thing. Remake the axe. Uh, so right now we have like two traps going, one for the lizards inside the... Oh, a stone hut. So we need 100% crafting for that. Uh, well, I definitely want to build one. We'll build it in wetlands, I guess. That was always my home away from home, Wetlands was. Okay, kind of cool. Uh, okay, Mr. Nibbles, today you stay home and Jeffrey goes with me. How's the malaria thing going up? Okay, how's the bug bites? Okay, still pretty high, good. Right, you know, the drill. Goats, partridges, then we head out. <laughs> Partridge paradise. We're living most of our lives, living in a portrait paradise. Okay, oh, I put an egg there by accident, whoops. We should start eating these partridges because, you know, we have like a, an explosion of partridges here. And we will, we will eat some of them. So for partridges, what do you need to, to, to eat them? We're gonna need... Um, so partridges, oil, some greens, and salt. Okay, all of these are super easy to get, so. 
Okay, let's go. Uh, wait. How's my spear doing? Where is my spear? Oh, right, it's on the shoulder. Whoops. Okay, we leveled crafting. So swimming, climbing, cooking, fishing, hunting. Right, we are working on all of those. Right now we are mostly working on like diving and climbing though. Oh, where is my rope? I wonder if it works from there. Train climbing helps a little. Draw attention. So this is for hunting. Oh, hello there. Oh, it's just a carcass. Oh, well. Okay, let's go to the beach. So change locations where you train at if you want to train faster. I made a whole video about it, so nice. There we go, use the spear, some more hunting, training, I guess we, oh, of course, that fits inside there, right, okay, uh, dive, oh, we should also spear fish, right, that's another thing that we wanted to train here, and there we go, and then go to the rocks, my spear fishing is still pretty low, so it's gonna take a while to level, but I'm gonna get there. Sort that, do that, oh, another one, nice, a big one this time, I think rocks are much better to to fish than the bitches, uh, okay, I don't think we need that, explore a little bit, a lot of food, well, we certainly won't lack food, that's what it seems to be here, where is the cave anyway, cave, so many animals. Oh boy. No cave yet. Okay, I'm gonna head back now. Oh, we can make the cocktail. Uh, sticks. Okay, that's good. Okay, fish. Dive. Climb. Okay, then bay. Let's take a little bit of a break, dive, fish, climb, there we go, draw attention, hello there mister, hopefully never comes back, no, no, don't say that, hopefully it does come back, we want more pets, we have only two pets, I want like six pets, why do I want six pets, well, I just do, okay, let's go inside, how's my malaria doing? That's built pretty low still. Okay. Did I nerf that thing? I don't know. Okay, this thing's empty, so we're gonna need to fill it up. Uh, where's like my my tinder or leaves or something like that? Okay, I guess we put it all in the satchel, which is also fine. Oh yeah, and then the box. I was like, this thing's not gonna go out, so why would we like, mm, you know, even have tinder around, like? That's that's not very useful, is it? Right, so we can make we can make all kinds of wonderful things now. Let's make a let's make a coconut uh, cup. It's been a while since we ate that seafood cup. Oh, we just unlocked it. Okay, I guess we'll have to learn it how to make it first. <laughs> that's random. Okay. Uh, meanwhile. We're gonna need another basket for food, it seems like. Okay, there you go, there you go, good. Uh, fish. Right, let's salt this fish. And there, oh. Nothing there for you guys, okay. Right. Okay, salt some more fish. You're like super hungry though. Okay. Uh, Let's cook that. And next thing is gonna be another fish. There we go. So the riding fish. I'm gonna put those. I could put it in a random stuff for now. So those will be for baits for uh, various, um, you know, my traps that I'm having. Okay. Some more fish scraps. Okay. Let's salt this. Okay, the fish scraps are ready. There we go. 
Vase not, want not, right? Okay, what else are we gonna do? Okay, we got a drying salted fish here. I'll put that inside there, and let's see what else. Right, did we finally learn how to make the cup? Not yet, I don't think so. Uh, right, let's salt another one here. There we go. Put that inside there. So we're salting the good food, and then we are eating the bad food. Okay, let's clean. Okay, I'm gonna eat these. Doesn't take any time to eat these. That's kind of cool, actually. And there we go. Eat until we are sick of the eggs. There we go. Good. Next thing. Uh, what else? Okay, we definitely want to do that. Okay, we are sleepy. So let's go and sleep. Yeah. Like, my my immune system's not the best, so I'm wondering why does malaria go up so slowly. Okay, we discovered a new blueprint. Let's make ourselves a nice seafood cup. There we go. Wonderful. We're gonna need some water, though. No problem. There you go. You can also use coconut water for it, if you like. Let's showcase that, although we already did showcase that in the other playthrough, but let's open a coconut here. nothing better than some flavor here okay you cannot use it like that but if you put it inside there then you can you also need only half of it so if you want to be like frugal about it there we go nice seafood cup let's bring this cocoa water i guess okay we got an excess crab here really why do we have an extra crab lying around i don't know anyhow oh we got glue. We got glue, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, right. So we're going to need slaked lime and a crafting tool. Okay, okay. We can do that. We can certainly do that. Okay, that's lunch. See? Don't steal from me. Make your own broom. Or you're going to end up like that okay there we go how's our friends yeah a little bit thirsty let's give them some water there we go i don't know who was the last one who went with me but hey that's gonna work right we're gonna need some lime so let's go grab some uh trap triggered okay let's remake these there we go trapping pretty high by now okay do we need to drink a little bit okay how are the goats doing? Well, they are doing a lot of poo poo, that's alright. So the, the new goats are progressing nicely. They don't drink a lot. They drink surprisingly little. Yeah, that was rebalanced like 10 times. No, not really, but I almost feel like it, right? Right, seems like a lot of chicks are being made right now. Okay, well, Alan was pretty busy making sure the eggs are nice and fertilized. And let's go to wetlands. I forgot why we're coming here. Okay, let's check this thing. Right, this is still drying. Maybe it's not gonna work out. It's But it's gonna dry up and then after that, it will definitely trigger. But then the question is if it's gonna catch it or not. It might. Uh, let me remember what I came here for. So, like, I was making glue and I need, oh yeah, I need slaked slight lime for that. Okay, let's grab some quick lime then. Not sure how much I need. Uh, pretty sure I don't need that much though. Okay, gonna re need to remake some tools and stuff here soon. Okay. Oh, we got four urchins. We can make like a lot of um, a lot of nice stuff with it. I'm gonna do some bugs here while we are here. I mean, we could, we could for the trapping, right? Let's do like nine. Oops. There we go. And practice rock throwing. <laughs> That's an interesting skill, a blast from the past. So the first episode I ever recorded of this game was uh, me uh, rock throwing uh, the coconuts and it didn't take any time back then. So you could just do it over and over again. And it was like a super way and super easy way to like get coconuts. And then uh, the developers saw it and then they patched it. And the next day, 
Well, I already made an episode the next day and called it like, we are restarting the series this time, we are not abusing coconuts. And then the developer came and they said they fixed it, so yeah, it was kind of a... And I don't know, that's how it all started. It was in interesting times. It really was. Finding a new game, loving it, and then developers like starting to interact with you. Well, we came a long way since then. Anyhow, we're gonna need some slaked lime here. So we put lime inside water, right? Yep, okay, good. And then we're gonna need a knife to make all of that work. You need a tool. And we're gonna make some glue here. There we go. And then we need to cook it. Wait, what? Don't tell me that bug is still in the game. Uh, glue. Oh no, you need a pot of water. Okay. It used to be that you were getting three pots out of it. Uh, yeah. Anyhow, uh, let's put the quick climb inside here. Now, I'm not sure if we're gonna need some more. Uh, so let's see, for the trophy, we're gonna need three glue, the shark jaws, and 12 pretty seashells. Okay, let's wait with cooking the glue. Let's wait with cooking the glue. Uh, we have more urgent matters here. We need 12 seashells. Okay, let's start looking for them. First, we're gonna go to the rocks. Actually, no, first let's go check out the dark cave. There might be some in there. Uh, yeah, wetlands. 12. And I am working on letting parasites develop here, but it's going super slow. I can't help much with that. Maybe I shouldn't have put that bug repellent on me at that point, but hey. Okay, we got one pretty seashell here. Well, you know what they say? That's a start. That's a start. And I should definitely keep an eye out on these. Uh, bay. Let's explore here a little bit. Maybe we find some. I don't know. Okay, that's not it. I think I turned them all into lime. Yeah, I'm regretting that. No, I totally forgot. Okay, well, <laughs> the beach is finally 100% explored. Um, that took a little bit longer than you would usually expect. Yeah, I don't know what's the best place to, to get those. It might be this one. Let's check out the... Oh, we didn't even find the cave yet. Yeah. Okay, well, there's some. My shoes protected me, isn't that wonderful? Two done, like 12 more to go. Yeah, I... <laughs> <laughs> you can do it, let's go. I mean, it's not like we have anything else smart to do. The bees are probably swarming and we could go. Okay, well, this is, uh, this is our cue to stop. Because right now we are not protected anymore. But we should have some. Yep. So this should be infinite, so... It's just a matter of, you know, spending enough time doing it. But yeah, everything else is in order, like... We have enough food for partridges, we have enough stuff for the goats. Uh, I guess the the stove will run out, but other than that, it's, it's mostly fine. At least we don't have to go and try to catch a shark. Trust me, that one takes even longer. Speaking of sharks, let's do train a little bit here, why not? It bit me, okay. Now that's a nasty bite, um, but you can just, uh, you can just ignore it. But don't uh, don't go diving again. You need to wait for the thing to pass. Otherwise, you might uh, die from uh, asphyxiation, suffocation, something like that. Anyhow, let's check out the partridge paradise. Do you guys eat that? No, you don't. All right. Okay. Check out the goat's heaven. Seems everything's under control here. Yeah, it, you don't have to check animals often, doesn't seem like it. I'm checking them just in case, but you know. What's inside here? Fertilizer and ash, okay. Uh, 
There we go. Okay, let's go inside. Well, first day relatively successful. That mouse spoiled, so... Oh no, what are we gonna do? That's so bad. Okay, do that. Do that. Fill that up. What are we gonna eat? Like, we can eat an egg, we can eat that thing. These, I don't know. Some coconut stuff. Oh, look at that. We have some food with us already. A little bit of an egg, a little bit of a that. And then we're gonna top it off with a juicy crab. There we go. Let's go chop some trees down because we are pretty much getting low run food. This reservoir is not gonna last forever though, so we'll see. Not sure what kind of season we are in right now, but hey. Powers and Malara is still going up, so that's nice. Uh, that's what we want to showcase. So, let's see. The C trophy. So we got three, right? Well, we're gonna get there. Place this thing down. There we go. Um, cook some more eggs. Oh yeah, I wanted to cut down some trees. Of course, of course, well of course. So here's the thing that came from the sea crate. Makes it harder to walk and burst your vision. Can kill you if it gets too high. So it's a venom, it's a crate venom. So, have to be careful about it. So once you get bitten by a crate, you really don't want to get bitten by another one. And that's about it. That's how you avoid any problems with it. So just stop doing whatever made you get bitten in the first place and you will be fine, so yeah. Okay. Okay, we got some, okay, we can destroy that. I guess let's make a, an island chicken or something. Uh, island chicken. There we go, we're gonna need some salt for that. Okay, we're out of salt, so tomorrow we should take care of that. There we go, cook that. What else do we have here? These are spoiling, but they're not near spoiling yet. Okay, we can do that. And there we go. Okay, we're gonna put feathers and stuff into the useful crap thing. Get put that in there. Mm. Yeah, let's uh, let's feed the monkeys and go to sleep. There we go. Yeah, I know, I know. Fish crabs suck, but you saw me eating them the other day, so. You know that they are good for you, otherwise I would definitely not eat them, right? Right. Okay, let's make the food wrappings before I forget. There we go. Oh, island chicken's done. Good, good, good. Cooking almost 100%, look at that. And let's grab our leather shoes now. There we go, and do the food wrappings. Wonderful. Bam. Good. Okay, oil. Yeah, let's go to sleep. I think we might like rest a little bit more. This will definitely not fill it up to full. Yeah, so let's rest for one more hour here. Five hours per sleep is usually enough in this game. Okay, let's make another yarn. Okay. And do some of those. Okay, 4 a.m. Uh, how's the malaria? Still going up, so that's fine. Let me just confirm. We have five kinkona bark powder. Right, we can eat it raw, or we can make quinine from it. Oh, we need dried No, that's quinine. That's already quinine. Uh, good for treating malaria, so we can eat or we can drink it, I think. No, we can't. So we just eat it, I guess. Yeah. Okay. Now we're gonna do it when we get there. Okay. Do that, do that. Let's go out and chop some wood. But uh, yeah, I think we're gonna wrap it up here. There's no way. Like, we have like seven more minutes here before one hour, which I don't want to go across. And then I don't think the RNG gods will give us enough seashells. But uh, in the next episode, we will definitely go and drop some. And um, yeah, we're gonna make a, a shark thing. Okay, but let's use this time to do some useful things. We're gonna grab the fertilizer here. We grab some manure. I'm gonna carry that into the caves. Okay, I don't think we need these here, so I'm gonna throw them away. Drop that. Well, actually, 
put it like this. There. Yep. Let's go into the... Yeah, let's go check the trap. Okay, dry salted fish is complete. So I think now this thing will re-trigger. You know what? I'm gonna do it like this. So now it's perfectly 100% ready. Yeah, I guess... Uh, although the lizards will come to your base and eat, I think, dry it, the fish that's like drying. I guess you cannot use it in the traps. But I tried. I tried. Okay, unspoilable food. Okay, there's where the chilies are. Okay. Do we have anything in here? No. Okay. Let's go out. Let's go back. Then I'm gonna check the grasslands. We might have a lizard there waiting for us. No. Okay. There we go. I guess we're gonna do that in the next episode. And it's raining. Wonderful. Very happy about that. So this is a really, really happy ending to this episode. Like... Uh, the reservoir is half dry, but then another rain comes and we don't have to worry about it for quite a bit longer, actually. So, yeah. Now, we're gonna fill this up. Doesn't really matter too much because we have three reservoirs outside filling up with rainwater. Okay, uh, Mr. Nibbles, you're gonna be our new traveling companion. Jeffrey, there you go, some water for you. Oh, some more. There we go. Let's see, do we have any food to feed you with? Okay, we got a couple of eggs. Okay, I don't want to eat. Do you want to eat? You want to eat? I want to eat. Everyone wants to eat. Good. Uh, let's, uh, let's take a little bit of a break here. Then I'm going to wash and I'm uh, going to wrap this one up. Right, so we did a lot of training in this one. That was one of my goals, to get the skills up as high as possible. We actually have the glue ready, we just need to cook it. So then we'll be able to build a sea trophy, but we got stopped by the most unfortunate thing, and that's pretty seashells. We need like nine more of them. Of course, I could break this apart and make it from these, but I don't want to do that. Those are really important for me. Uh, you know what, let's actually do that. Gonna remake the food wrapping so they're as close together as possible in terms of durability. And there we go. So remake our gear here. Had a had a really really lucky coconut climb. That one was like a gift from the game. <laughs> so yeah, and we are raising malaria, so I can show you how to treat it. But apparently it raises so slow that I'm like questioning like how do you even get that thing. Like, it must be like a very long period of neglect. I mean, it's rising still, which is, you know what? If we can remove all the bug bites and this thing will still be rising, then maybe I should like start working on it. Yeah. It might be that like it's hard to get, but also very hard to get rid of it. Yeah, that's certainly the possibility, right? There we go. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this episode. I hopefully you enjoyed it. If you have any questions, suggestions, ideas, make sure to let me know in the comments. Of course, uh, like and subscribe. In the meantime, I wish you all to have a wonderful day. I'll do something nice. Be kind to each other. Thank you all for watching. And I will see you in the next episode. And don't forget to name the female goats. Niemar Sanyat. Bye-bye.